So what can we learn about the speaking style of Mitt Romney? He has a lot of strengths, but he also has weaknesses, as most of us do. His strengths are that he comes across highly intelligent, very articulate, he can be forceful, and when pushed or highly motivated, he can come across with good energy and occasional passion. He's clearly done his homework, he's thought about his messages, if he's attacking an opponent, he's got specific research for it. So you never get the sense that he's lazy, you never get the sense that he's just winging it, and you don't get the sense that he's disrespecting the audience by having not prepared. Mitt Romney is someone who comes prepared for major presentations, he comes prepared for major debates. Where is he weak? There are times when Mitt Romney just seems a bit too programmed, a bit too canned, and a bit too phony. Where he often gets himself into trouble is not the prepared speech text that he delivers. It's during the question and answer session where he says certain sound bites that get him into trouble. Corporations are people, my friend. I don't really care about poor people. There's been numerous examples of a sound bite that gets him off trouble, uh, gets him off message and in trouble. And this happens because he doesn't realize the difference between what sounds good in the context of an entire speech versus what is going to look good when just that four or five or six word phrase is blown up into headlines and nobody sees the beginning and the after. He is improving and that is a lesson we can all learn. The more you speak, the better you get. Thank you.